100 simple fish sauces. Admiral Sauce Add two pounded anchovies, four chopped shallots, a teaspoonful of chopped capers, and a little grated lemon peel to one cupful of drawn butter sauce. Reheat, season with salt and pepper and lemon juice. Serve hot. Albert Sauce Boil three chopped shallots with a tablespoonful of butter and one-fourth cupful of vinegar. Add one cupful of freshly grated horseradish, half a cupful of white stock, and one cupful of veloute sauce. Boil until thick. Rub through a sieve. Reheat. Add the yolks of three eggs beaten with a cupful of cream, two tablespoonfuls of butter in small bits, and a little minced parsley. Alamond Sauce 1. Pour two cupfuls of white stock into a saucepan with half a dozen mushrooms chopped fine, a two-inch strip of lemon peel, salt and pepper to season, and a teaspoonful of minced parsley. Simmer for an hour and strain. Thicken with a teaspoonful of flour rubbed smooth in a little cold stock or water. Take from the fire and add the yolks of three eggs beaten with the juice of half a lemon. Reheat but do not boil. Take from the fire and add a tablespoonful of butter. Alamond Sauce 2 Cook together two tablespoonfuls of butter and three of flour. Add two cupfuls of white stock and cook until thick, stirring constantly. Beat the yolks of three eggs and add the sauce gradually to the eggs, beating constantly. Strain, add the juice of half a lemon and a tablespoonful of butter. Serve hot. Anchovy Butter Soak, bone, dry, and pound eight salted anchovies. Add twice their bulk of fresh butter. Mix thoroughly. Press forcibly through a fine sieve. Add a little more butter and the juice of a lemon. Make into small pats and keep in a cold place. Anchovy Butter Sauce Prepare a pint of brown sauce according to directions elsewhere given and season with melted butter, lemon juice, and anchovy essence. Anchovy Sauce 1 Stir two tablespoonfuls of anchovy essence into one cupful of melted butter. Season with cayenne and powdered mace. Anchovy Sauce 2 Pound three anchovies smooth with three tablespoonfuls of butter. Add two teaspoonfuls of vinegar and a quarter of a cupful of water. Bring to the boil and thicken with a tablespoonful of flour rubbed smooth in a little cold water. Strain through a sieve and serve hot. Anchovy Sauce 3 Add a tablespoonful of anchovy paste to a cupful of drawn butter sauce and season with lemon juice and paprika. Aurora Sauce Add one half cupful of mushroom liquor to one cupful of bechamel sauce. Add also three tablespoonfuls of stewed and strained tomatoes and one tablespoonful of butter. Reheat, add a few cooked mushrooms cut into dice, and serve. Avignonese sauce. Chop together four shallots and two beans of garlic. Fry in olive oil. Add two cupfuls of bechamel sauce. Bring to the boil. Add the yolks of three eggs, two tablespoonfuls of grated Parmesan cheese, and a little minced parsley. Heat but do not boil, and use as soon as it thickens. Bernays Sauce 1. Bring to the boil two tablespoonfuls each of vinegar and water. Simmer in it for 10 minutes a slice of onion. Take out the onion and add the yolks of three eggs beaten very light. Take from the fire, add salt and pepper to season, and four tablespoonfuls of butter beaten to a cream. The butter should be added in small bits. Bernays Sauce 2. Beat the yolks of five eggs. Add a pinch of salt and one tablespoonful of butter. Heat in a double boiler until it begins to thicken. Then take from the fire and add two more tablespoonfuls of butter. Season with minced fine herbs and parsley and add a teaspoonful of tarragon vinegar. Bernays Sauce 3 
Beat the yolks of two eggs very light and put into a double boiler. Add gradually three tablespoonfuls of olive oil, then the same quantity of boiling water, then one tablespoonful of lemon juice. Season with salt and cayenne and serve immediately. Quick Bernays Sauce Beat the yolks of four eggs with four tablespoonfuls of oil and four of water. Add a cupful of boiling water and cook slowly until thick and smooth. Take from the fire and add minced onion, capers, olives, pickles, and parsley, and a little tarragon vinegar. Bechamel Sauce Cook together two tablespoonfuls each of butter and flour. Add two cupfuls of white stock and cook until thick, stirring constantly. Season with salt, pepper, and grated nutmeg. Bombay Sauce Season drawn butter sauce highly with chopped pickle, curry powder, and tarragon vinegar. Bordelaise Sauce Fry in butter a tablespoonful of chopped shallots and two minced beans of garlic. Add half a cupful of claret, a pinch of red pepper, and a pint of espagnol sauce. Boil until thick. Take from the fire and add lemon juice and minced parsley to season. Add also a quarter of a pound of beef marrow cut into small pieces and parboiled in salted water. Serve at once. White Bordelaise Sauce Fry a tablespoonful of chopped onions in butter. Add a wine glass full of white wine and a cupful of velouté sauce. Season to taste. Boil for five minutes. Take from the fire. Add one tablespoonful each of minced parsley, lemon juice, and butter. Brown Sauce 1 Brown two tablespoonfuls of flour in butter. Add two cupfuls of milk or cream and cook until thick, stirring constantly. Brown Sauce 2 Fry in pork fat two slices of onion, a slice of carrot, a bay leaf, and a sprig of parsley. Add a heaping teaspoonful of flour and, when brown, a cupful of stock. Cook until thick, stirring constantly. Take from the fire, strain, add the juice of half a lemon, and salt and pepper to taste. Brown Butter Sauce Melt butter in a frying pan and cook until brown, taking care not to burn. Take from the fire and add lemon juice or vinegar and salt and pepper to taste. Serve hot. Butter Sauce Mix chopped hard-boiled eggs with a liberal amount of melted butter. Season with salt, pepper, and minced parsley. Caper Sauce 1 Add half a cupful of capers to two cupfuls of drawn butter sauce. Caper Sauce 2 Prepare a pint of drawn butter sauce and add it to two tablespoonfuls of capers, a tablespoonful of anchovy essence, and salt and pepper to taste. Claret Sauce Reheat one cupful of brown sauce. Season with grated onion and half a cupful of claret. Bring to the boil and serve. Colbert Sauce Put into a saucepan one cupful of espagnole sauce, two tablespoonfuls of beef extract, the juice of a lemon, red and white pepper, and minced parsley to season, and half a cupful of butter in small bits. Heat, but do not boil, and serve at once. Cream Sauce Cook together one tablespoonful of butter and two of flour. Add two cupfuls of cream or milk and cook until thick, stirring constantly. Season with salt and pepper. Cucumber Sauce 1 Chop two cucumbers, drain, and add one tablespoonful of grated onion and half of a minced bean of garlic. Season with salt, pepper, and vinegar and add enough olive oil to make a smooth paste. Serve immediately. Cucumber Sauce 2 Grate four large cucumbers and drain. Season the pulp with salt, pepper, grated onion, and tarragon vinegar. Add enough whipped cream to make a smooth mixture and serve at once. Cucumber Sauce 3 Chop a cucumber finely. Season with salt, pepper, and vinegar and add it to hollandaise sauce. Curry Sauce Fry a tablespoonful of chopped onion in butter 
and add a tablespoonful of flour mixed with a teaspoonful of curry powder. Mix thoroughly, add one cupful of cold water, and cook until thick, stirring constantly. Take from the fire, season with salt and onion juice, and serve hot. Drawn Butter Sauce Cook to a smooth paste two tablespoonfuls of butter and two of flour. Add two cupfuls of cold water and cook until thick, stirring constantly. Season with salt and pepper. Dutch Sauce Cook together two tablespoonfuls each of butter and flour. Add one cupful of white stock and cook until thick, stirring constantly. Season with salt and pepper. Take from the fire and add the yolks of three eggs beaten with half a cupful of cream. Cook in a double boiler for three minutes. Take from the fire, add a tablespoonful of lemon juice, and strain. Duxelle Sauce 1 Cook in butter one cupful of chopped mushrooms and one tablespoonful each of minced onion and parsley. Add to one pint of Spanish sauce and serve. Duxelle Sauce 2 Prepare a pint of velouté sauce. Add a wine glassful of white wine and two tablespoonfuls of beef extract. Boil for five minutes. Add two tablespoonfuls each of chopped mushrooms and cooked beef, tongue, or ham. Add a little minced parsley. Reheat and serve. Egg sauce one. Add one half cupful of sliced or chopped hard-boiled eggs to two cupfuls of drawn butter sauce. Egg sauce 2. Prepare a cream sauce according to directions previously given and add the yolks of two raw eggs, a tablespoonful of grated onion, a hard-boiled egg chopped fine, and a teaspoonful of minced parsley. Espanol sauce. Add a small bay leaf, a blade of mace, and two cloves to two cupfuls of white stock. Simmer for 15 minutes. Cook together two tablespoonfuls of butter and three of flour. Add the heated stock and cook until thick, stirring constantly. Add one tablespoonful each of chopped ham, onion, celery, carrot, and parsley, with salt and paprika to season. Simmer for an hour, strain, and serve very hot. Fine Herb Sauce 1 Fry in butter one tablespoonful each of minced parsley and onion. Add to one pint of white sauce and reheat. Season with salt and pepper and serve. Fine Herb Sauce 2 Prepare according to directions given for brown Italian sauce using butter instead of oil and half a cupful of minced parsley instead of the thyme and bay leaf. Season with grated nutmeg and add to either Spanish or velouté sauce. Flemish Sauce Prepare a cupful of drawn butter sauce. Take from the fire, add the yolks of two eggs well beaten, and pepper, grated nutmeg, made mustard, vinegar, and minced parsley to season. Add gradually half a cup of melted butter and serve. Garlic Sauce Peel the garlic and boil for an hour, changing the water four times. Drain, chop, and mix to a smooth paste with melted butter. The flavor is mild and resembles almond. Sauce a la Gascon Chop together a tablespoonful of capers and a bean of garlic. Fry in olive oil, seasoning with pepper and grated nutmeg. Add a wine glassful of white wine, a cupful of velouté sauce, a bay leaf, and a sprig of thyme. Boil for 15 minutes. Skim. Add another wine glassful of white wine. Strain and add the yolks of three eggs well beaten. Season with lemon juice, butter, anchovy essence, and minced parsley. Geneva Sauce Brown one tablespoonful of flour in butter. Add two cupfuls of thick stock and one cupful of red wine and cook until thick, stirring constantly. Add two small onions chopped, a bunch of sweet herbs, two tablespoonfuls of chopped mushrooms, and salt and pepper to season. Simmer for half an hour. Add a wine glassful of Madeira, strain, and serve. Gooseberry Sauce Boil a pint of green gooseberries for 10 minutes in water to cover. Drain, press through a sieve, and mix with an equal quantity of white sauce. Hessian Sauce 
Mix four tablespoonfuls of freshly grated horseradish with an equal quantity of fresh breadcrumbs, a tablespoonful of sugar, and a little salt and pepper. Mix to a smooth paste with sour cream and serve with baked fish. Hollandaise Sauce 1 Beat half a cupful of butter to a cream and add gradually the yolks of two eggs well beaten. Then add the juice of half a lemon and pepper and salt to season. Place the bowl over boiling water and beat with an egg beater until thick and smooth. Take from the fire and beat for a few moments. Be careful not to cook it too long. Hollandaise Sauce 2 Put a bay leaf and a chopped onion in two tablespoonfuls of tarragon vinegar. Bring to the boiling point, strain, and cool. Cook together two tablespoonfuls of butter and one of flour. Add a half a cupful of cold water and cook until thick, stirring constantly. Take from the fire and add the yolks of two eggs beaten with the vinegar. Reheat for a moment, seasoning with salt and pepper. Strain and serve immediately. Lemon juice may be used in place of the vinegar. Horseradish Sauce 1 Add half a cupful of freshly grated horseradish to a cupful of drawn butter sauce. Season with lemon juice and beat until smooth. Horseradish Sauce 2 Prepare a cream sauce according to directions previously given and add three tablespoonfuls of freshly grated horseradish and half a cupful of melted butter. Serve with boiled fish. Horseradish Sauce 3 to one cupful of Spanish sauce, add two tablespoonfuls of prepared horseradish, two tablespoonfuls of breadcrumbs, a teaspoonful of powdered sugar, and salt, pepper, and made mustard to season. Heat in a double boiler, and just before serving, add one half cupful of whipped or cold cream, cow cream, not cosmetic. Italian sauce. Fry in butter two tablespoonfuls of minced parsley and one tablespoonful of chopped mushrooms and shallots. Add two cupfuls of white wine and boil until reduced half. Add one cupful of velouté sauce and one half cupful of stock. Boil until thick, skim, and serve. Brown Italian Sauce Fry in olive oil half a cupful of chopped mushrooms, four chopped shallots, a sprig of thyme, and a bay leaf. Add half a cupful of white wine and simmer until the liquid is reduced half. Take out the thyme and bay leaf, add a cupful of Spanish sauce, skim, boil, and serve. Japanese Sauce Chop fine a shallot and two cloves of garlic. Add two tablespoonfuls each of walnut ketchup, soy, and Worcestershire sauce. Season highly with paprika. Add two cupfuls of tarragon vinegar and let stand for two weeks. Strain and serve with fish. Jersey sauce. Brown four tablespoonfuls of flour in butter. Add two cupfuls of brown stock and cook until thick, stirring constantly. Season with salt, pepper, and Worcestershire. Lemon sauce one. Melt half a cupful of butter and add it to the juice of a large lemon. When very hot, take from the fire and pour over the well-beaten yolks of two eggs. Lemon Sauce 2 Prepare a pint of drawn butter sauce according to directions previously given. Season with salt, pepper, grated nutmeg, and lemon juice and add half a cupful of melted butter. Livornaise Sauce Soak bone and pound to a pulp eight salted anchovies. Add the yolks of two eggs well beaten. Add slowly half a cupful of olive oil and two tablespoonfuls of vinegar. Season with pepper, grated nutmeg, and minced parsley. Serve very cold. Lobster sauce one. Add half a cupful of chopped cooked lobster meat and the pounded coral to each cupful of drawn butter sauce. Season with paprika, butter, and lemon juice. Lobster Sauce 2 Prepare a hollandaise sauce and mix with finely cut cooked lobster meat. Season with melted butter, lemon juice, Tabasco, and Worcestershire. Maitre d'hôtel sauce Work into half a cupful of butter all the lemon juice it will take and add a teaspoonful or more of minced parsley. Or melt the butter without burning, take from the fire, Add the juice of half a lemon and a teaspoonful of minced parsley. Mayonnaise. 
Put into an earthen bowl the yolk of a fresh egg and a pinch of salt, a dash of red pepper, and half a teaspoonful of dry mustard. Place the bowl on ice or in ice water. Pour one cupful of olive oil into a small pitcher from which it will drop easily. When the egg and seasoning are thoroughly mixed, begin to add the oil using a silver teaspoon and rubbing rather than stirring. Add the oil until a clear spot is formed upon the egg and then mix until smooth. Only a few drops can be added at first, but the quantity may be gradually increased. The clear spot on the egg is an infallible test of the right quantity of oil. If too much oil is added, the dressing will curdle. A few drops of lemon juice and a long beating will usually make it right again. If this fails, set the bowl directly on the ice in the refrigerator and let stand for half an hour. If it is still curdled, begin again with the yolk of another egg and add the curdled mayonnaise by degrees to the new dressing. When the mayonnaise is so thick that it is difficult to stir, add the juice of half a lemon if desired. Milanese Sauce Melt two tablespoonfuls of butter, add two chopped mushrooms and two boned and pounded anchovies. Add two tablespoonfuls of flour and cook until the flour is brown. Add one cupful of brown stock and one tablespoonful each of sherry and vinegar drained from capers. Cook until thick, stirring constantly, seasoning with salt, cayenne, and made mustard. Simmer for 20 minutes, strain, add one tablespoonful of capers, boil for five minutes, and serve. Mushroom sauce. Prepare a drawn butter sauce according to directions previously given and add to it one cupful of chopped, cooked mushrooms. Niçoise sauce. Rub through a fine sieve the yolks of three hard-boiled eggs. Put into a deep bowl with two raw yolks, a tablespoonful of made mustard, and salt and pepper to season. Add gradually half a cupful of olive oil and a little vinegar, finishing with two tablespoonfuls of minced fine herbs. Nonpareil sauce. Add chopped hard-boiled eggs and chopped cooked mushrooms to hollandaise sauce. Normandy sauce. Add one tablespoonful of mushroom catsup to one pint of velouté sauce and cook for 10 minutes. Add one-fourth cupful of strong fish stock, bring to the boil, take from the fire, and add the yolks of two eggs beaten with the juice of half a lemon. Strain, add a tablespoonful of butter, and serve. Olive sauce. Prepare according to directions given for Jersey sauce, adding half a dozen chopped olives instead of the Worcestershire. Oyster sauce one. Prepare a cream sauce according to directions previously given, using the oyster liquor for part of the liquid. Add parboiled oysters cut fine and season with paprika and lemon juice. Oyster sauce 2. Cook two dozen oysters in their liquor with a little water, butter, white and red pepper, and grated nutmeg. Thicken with a tablespoonful each of butter and flour cooked together. Take from the fire. Add the yolks of two eggs well beaten, the juice of a lemon, and two tablespoonfuls of butter. Serve with boiled fish. Parsley Sauce 1. Prepare a drawn butter sauce according to directions previously given. Add half a cupful of fine minced parsley and season with lemon juice. Parsley Sauce 2. Boil two large bunches of parsley in water to cover for five minutes. Strain the water and thicken with a tablespoonful each of butter and flour cooked together. Season with salt, pepper, and grated nutmeg. Take from the fire. Add the yolks of two eggs beaten with a little vinegar, three tablespoonfuls of butter in small bits, and a little minced parsley. Parsley and Lemon Sauce Squeeze the juice out of a lemon. Remove the seeds and chop the pulp fine with a bunch of parsley. Add a little of the grated peel. Cook together one tablespoonful each of butter and flour. Add the parsley and the lemon and one and one-half cupfuls of stock. Season with salt, pepper, and powdered mace. And boil for 10 minutes. Take from the fire. Add the yolks of two eggs beaten with a little cold stock. And serve. Persillade sauce. 
Put into a bowl one fourth cupful of olive oil with a tablespoonful of made mustard, the juice of two lemons, and two tablespoonfuls of minced parsley, and salt and pepper to season. Add a few drops of tarragon vinegar, mix thoroughly, and serve. Piquant Sauce 1. Cook together a teaspoonful of chopped onion, a pinch of sugar, a few drops of Worcestershire sauce, and one tablespoonful each of chopped capers and pickles, with two tablespoonfuls of tarragon vinegar, and salt and cayenne to season. Prepare a Spanish sauce and add the mixture to it. Piquant Sauce 2. Mix together half a cupful of beef stock, two tablespoonfuls of tarragon vinegar, two tablespoonfuls of chopped pickle, one tablespoonful each of chopped onion, capers, and parsley, a teaspoonful each of sugar and salt and paprika to season. Poor man's sauce. Brown a tablespoonful of flour in butter. Add two cupfuls of stock and cook until thick, stirring constantly. Add two tablespoonfuls of tomato catsup and one of anchovy essence. Strain and serve. Portuguese sauce. Put six tablespoonfuls of butter into a saucepan with the yolks of two eggs beaten with the juice of half a lemon. Season with salt and pepper and heat thoroughly but do not boil. Take from the fire, stir until thick, and serve immediately. Poulette sauce. Simmer for ten minutes a pint of white sauce, seasoning with salt, pepper, and lemon juice. Beat the yolks of three eggs light and pour the hot sauce over them slowly. Cook for two minutes in a double boiler and serve immediately. Ravigot sauce. Put one cupful of stock into a saucepan with two tablespoonfuls of white wine and three tablespoonfuls of chopped chives and parsley. Season with salt and pepper and simmer for 20 minutes. Thicken with one tablespoonful each of butter and flour cooked together. Take from the fire Add the juice of half a lemon and serve. Cold Ravigot Sauce Chop together a tablespoonful each of parsley, chives, chervil, tarragon, and shallot. Add to a stiff mayonnaise and tint green if desired with color paste. Remoulade Sauce Mix two tablespoonfuls each of capers and minced anchovies. Add a tablespoonful of minced parsley, a teaspoonful of dry mustard, and salt and pepper to taste. Add one half bean of garlic, chopped very fine, and enough olive oil to make a smooth paste. Add a few drops of vinegar and serve. Royale sauce. Cook together half a cupful of butter and the beaten yolks of three eggs until the yolks begin to thicken. Take from the fire and add by degrees two tablespoonfuls of tarragon vinegar, two tablespoonfuls of Indian soy, one finely chopped small pickle, and cayenne and salt to season. Mix thoroughly and cool. Serve cold. Sardine sauce. Add skinned, boned, and mashed sardines to mayonnaise. Beat until smooth and serve with cold fish. Shad roe sauce. Boil, drain, skin, and mash a shad roe. Season with salt, pepper, grated onion, and powdered mace. Add half a cupful of Madeira and half a cupful or more of melted butter. Serve with shad or any other fish. Shrimp sauce. Add one cupful of chopped cooked shrimps to each pint of white sauce. Season with lemon juice, paprika, and Tabasco sauce. Sicilian sauce. Slice four onions, Fry brown and drain carefully. Put into a saucepan with two cupfuls of Espanol sauce, a wine glass full of sherry, and a pinch of cayenne pepper. Reheat, strain, and serve. Spanish sauce. Prepare according to directions given for brown sauce, using one cupful of highly seasoned stock for liquid. Supreme sauce. Prepare according to directions given for drawn butter sauce, using chicken stock and a little cream for liquid. Take from the fire and add two tablespoonfuls of butter and the juice of half a lemon. Tartar sauce 1. Chop together capers, olives, parsley, and pickles. Add one half cupful of the mixture to a cupful of mayonnaise. 
Tartar sauce, too. Mix together one tablespoonful each of vinegar and Worcestershire sauce. Add a teaspoonful of lemon juice and a pinch of salt. Brown half a cupful of butter and strain into the hot vinegar. Serve hot. Tartar sauce 3. Prepare a cupful of drawn butter sauce and add it to a teaspoonful each of made mustard, grated onion, and chopped pickle. Take from the fire. Season with salt and cayenne. Add the beaten yolk of an egg and serve. Tomato sauce 1. Prepare according to directions given for drawn butter sauce, using tomato juice or stewed and strained canned tomatoes for liquid. Tomato sauce 2. Chop together capers, pickles, onion, and olives. There should be half a cupful in all. Add one half cupful of stewed and strained tomatoes, a teaspoonful each of made mustard and sugar, and salt and cayenne to season highly. Serve very hot. Tomato sauce 3. Chop fine an onion and a clove of garlic. Fry in butter and add half a can of stewed and strained tomatoes. Thicken with butter and flour cooked together. Season with salt and pepper and serve. Brown tomato sauce. Fry a tablespoonful of chopped onion in butter. Add one tablespoonful of flour and one half cupful each of stock and stewed and strained tomato. Cook until thick, stirring constantly. Season with salt, pepper, and kitchen bouquet. Strain and serve. Volute sauce. Cook together three tablespoonfuls each of butter and flour. Add one cupful of white stock and one quarter cupful of cream. Cook until thick, stirring constantly. Season with salt, cayenne, grated nutmeg, and minced parsley. Simmer for an hour. Strain and serve. Venetienne sauce 1. Cook together for 5 minutes 2 tablespoonfuls of tarragon vinegar, 6 peppercorns, a tablespoonful of chopped ham, 6 parsley roots, a sprig of thyme, and a bay leaf. Strain and add to 1 cupful of velouté sauce. Reheat, add a teaspoonful of minced parsley, and serve. Venetienne sauce 2. Add minced parsley, tarragon vinegar, grated nutmeg, and a tablespoonful of butter to allemande sauce. Vinaigrette sauce. Mix four tablespoonfuls of olive oil with one tablespoonful of vinegar. Season with salt and paprika and add it to minced parsley, pickle, and capers. Whipped cream sauce. Mix a teaspoonful of dry mustard with a tablespoonful of vinegar and two tablespoonfuls of freshly grated horseradish. Mix with one-fourth cupful of mayonnaise and, when smooth, fold in carefully one cupful of whipped cream. Season with salt and red pepper and serve very cold with cold fish. White sauce. Cook together two tablespoonfuls each of butter and flour. Add one cupful of white stock and one half cupful of cream. Cook until thick, stirring constantly. Season with salt and pepper. One and one half cupfuls of milk may be used instead of the stock and cream.